And the world is witnessing a powerful resurgence of COVID-19. The U.S. grapples with record hospitalization rates, while Italy has seen the highest death toll since the autumn resurgence. Cases are also spiking in Brazil, including a series of cases among government officials. Our Yi Gyeong-un has more. Americans are preparing for Thanksgiving amid an exponential growth in COVID-19 cases. As of Monday, the U.S. has reported more than 12 million coronavirus cases and more than a quarter of a million deaths. That means hundreds of thousands of families will be missing their loved ones during the holiday due to the pandemic. Child infections have become a fresh concern after a 28 percent increase over the past two weeks. With more than 140,000 cases, child infections now account for more than 11 percent of all cases in the country. In the meantime, hospitalizations are at record highs. More than 85,800 COVID-19 patients were hospitalized on Monday. It is the 14th straight record-breaking day since the pandemic began. California is among the hardest hit. While Europe also grapples with spiking cases, Italy has seen the highest death toll on Tuesday since the autumn resurgence. That comes despite Italy being under a COVID-19 lockdown. But there is a bad figure, the one about the deaths, that unfortunately are 853. And signs of a second wave are being seen in Brazil. The number of cases has surpassed 6 million amid the latest surge. They include 13 high-ranking government officials. The health minister was one of them and had to be isolated for more than 10 days, leaving the critical post vacant. Yi Gang-un, Arirang News.